I fell in love with a Scorpio. It's a crazy story though. She was super pretty, the baddest in my portfolio. She was super sweet, I would eat her up like a Oreo. I don't know how I got her, I'm giving God all the glory though. And she was born in October or November. I really cannot remember. I hope it doesn't offend her. She told me that she loved me because I was so sweet and tender. And I would always defend her. And I was not a pretender. <laughs> but one day she was acting so mysterious. I was curious, and honestly, I was furious. Wasn't talking to me, she really had me delirious. I was overthinking, I didn't know she was serious. I thought maybe she had found somebody else but honestly she told me she was working on herself she took some time off to focus on her mental health and i had to accept it regardless of how i felt huh. but all in all what i learned in the end is i love scorpios i swear scorpios are 10 but be careful because as soon as you get in a woman that values herself is the most attractive thing for a man but also the most dangerous thing because you can't mess with these kind of women that value themselves when a woman knows her worth she is the most dangerous human being you are ever going to date because there's no time for games. So if you're a man, you're either going to make her better and she's going to make you better. Or if you're a boy, she's going to leave you and you got to find a way to become a man because these women don't have time to babysit. When a woman values herself and she sees a man, she's going to take the time to make sure she values him. But when she sees a boy, and she has to understand that she has to baby this boy she will respectfully leave and let you know that you're not ready what's up y'all this is 1020 at awakening and i'm back again with another motherfucking video what's up y'all how y'all doing i love my scorpios i know i've been a wall i have photography to do so you know i'm gonna do these videos for the day and then i'm about to do photography i really just want to get all my clients done today i don't want nobody to have nothing tomorrow because I just want to be done with it. I think I got a busy week next week too. Yeah, I got a busy week next week too. So it's just best for me to just handle this, okay? What's up, Scorpios? How y'all doing? I hope y'all looking good, feeling good, and spelling good. I feel kind of drained. I ain't going to flex today, all right? So soulmate, so Scorpio, you could feel like you had a soul connection with someone. Um, but soulmate is here with 14, okay? So, you know, this also means somebody miss you a lot. You know, somebody miss you, you can miss them. Okay, but soulmate is here, which just basically means your soul and this person has made it before. Okay, y'all have been a mate in another time. If you were born in the 80s, you are an old soul. You are here to, to impact the world in a way that's unconventional, untraditional. You are a way shower. Now, if people kill you off, 80s babies, you reincarnate as a lion, a tiger, an animal, a falcon, a bird, or eagle, and you do that viciously. You could attack people who are just nasty and mean, and I know you like, damn, when birds attack, you know, when the, when the tiger, but are you doing that because... This person or whoever this energy is, they reincarnated with you many other times and they stopped you from raising the vibration of the planet, okay? So 80s babies, all right, if you are 80s babies, you are here to usher in new consciousness, new ways of thinking. That's your job, you know? You can love old music and shit, but it's because you've been on this motherfucker a lot of times and you listen to a lot of genres, just a shout out for the 80s babies, all right? So there's a cycle that you keep going in and out of, Scorpio, all right? And that cycle is about to close. It has something to do with your home, and this is not true love, okay? So this, this romance is here for a lifetime. So there's a cycle that you're going in with a soulmate. This person could really like you, but you could need to put distance between you and this person. Y'all keep going through cycles where this person is in and out of your life, but you need to understand that this is not true love, okay? This ain't love. They don't love you like that. And whatever this has to do with, it's your home, okay? They could like being at your home. You could like being at their home. They don't like their home. I don't really know what the hell this is just saying, but this ain't true love in this home, okay? There's another storyline where someone is in a home with someone. There is no love in this home. This cycle is toxic as fuck. This person yearns for you, Scorpio, okay? They don't want to live in this house with these people. They want to be with you. They want a new cycle with you that has true love in it, okay, and stability. But this person just yearns for you. They just miss you. They don't do any actions towards you. But they're in something that's very toxic in their home, okay? And they really do love you with true love here in reverse, but they suppress the shit out of that. And they go through really bad cycles, and this person could be seeing 666, okay? Okay. <sighs> 
All right. This person really does want to separate with who they are. Also, for you, Scorpio, for that storyline where you really feel like somebody, you know, you miss them when they when it, when when you don't talk to them, you looking at their phone, your phone, you want them to communicate with you. Um, they they miss you too, but they don't love you. They miss something else about you. It's not love, y'all. It just could be lust, and you constantly go through some dumb ass cycle with this person. You need to focus on new people and new love. Separation with this purpose person is permanent. Okay. Uh, yeah, you need to let this shit go. You need to discover your life purpose. Maybe this person want to discover their life purpose with you, okay? Also, soulmates, again, all right? Then you have release your ex, damn. Then you got help from above, okay? So, Scorpio, um, some one of your exes are thinking about you. They don't really want you to find new love, okay? Somebody don't want you to stay in separation with them. You could be slowly letting them go because your ancestors is telling you, let this motherfucker go. Whoever this is, they can't release their ex or the pain that their ex caused them. So they continue to re revert back to cheating or messing with a lot of women or messing with a lot of men, okay? You are getting guides and, and intuitive guidance from your angels right now because you're discovering your life purpose and you will meet a soulmate. Now, you have two people who have a strong soul connection with you, all right? Somebody miss holding you, smelling you, sniffing you, being up under you. You also have another motherfucker that miss doing everything it says yes the soul yes your soul yes this is your soulmate so you got two people who feel like they have a strong spiritual connection with you somebody could play some kind of musical instrument as well but there's a lot of people kissing in this damn reading all right honestly scorpio somebody feels like they just met you they're very excited about meeting you they want to take you out to eat you could have plans this sunday to go out to eat with somebody this is new love okay after you realize that you need to separate from someone so somebody could be taking you out to eat, Scorpio. Get, get ready. Y'all need to post a picture, okay? So this Sunday, you could be going out to eat with somebody new after you decided to separate from someone energetically, okay? Somebody also could be sending you the evil eye, but we already know that, okay? Don't nobody give a fuck about nobody sending you the evil eye, okay? But it's out here, okay? Who gives a fuck? I know I don't. All right, Scorpio, you got new love coming in. You could be very optimistic about this new love after some kind of separation. All right, so somebody thinking about how they want to do something new or be something new after they separated from you. After they realize that they need to release their ex and they are getting signs from angels, they need to let go of the past. They also need to discover their future here. All right, so somebody is thinking about their future. All right, but like I said before, yeah, Scorpio, you could be seeing 777. You're on the right path, all right? Your purpose flows. So if you've been seeing a fox, stay away from people that come around you after you see a fox because that means that that person is sneaky and they have some kind of agenda. But you are on the right path, Scorpio. So just know that you're on the right path. There are some changes that need to be made. So be flexible about where you're going. You will be throwing a curveball, but it's okay. This curveball could have been this sneaky motherfucker. All right. Yeah. Cause this person used like they weren't good tactics. I mean, this was some weak. Whoever this was that you let come in your energy, Scorpio, they ain't even have to do much. Okay. You just you just let this person do it. I mean, you got your own reasons, but tactful is here in reverse. They they ain't even rise to no occasion. They didn't come with no bang. They just they just they just came so you know what i mean like what the fuck am <laughs> i you know what i'm saying like you know have a little bit of better more standards but i feel like if you know what you're doing ain't no 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 pressure your home is here in reverse so maybe some of you guys need to save your home okay because you need to end some kind of cycle all right and a soulmate just means somebody that you made it with all right that your soul remembers but it doesn't mean that you got to be with a soulmate forever some of y'all be trying to keep a motherfucking in your energy forever no bro all right all right, y'all. I love you guys. I hope these readings helped you. I will do a money read for y'all too for financial. Uh, Bitcoin is well over 51 at this time. Ethereum is slowly coming. Um, I have done financial changes where I've moved all my money to ETH and Bit and that's it. I do have other altcoins, but they're in, only in Coinbase. I like to try to update you guys on what I'm doing financially and strategies um, that I'm doing. I do want to do the the Thing. So if you want to do it, drop your cash app and I will start to write down everybody's cash app. I love you guys and I'll see y'all later. Bye.
Scorpios is really private, but we'll sting if you get close. And they rule by planet Mars, they stay determined, then don't go. Don't make a Scorpio strike because they venom pack a punch. So you better come correct, cause like a shark, you can't get much. Scorpios get what they want, and what they want is what they get. They appreciate the ones they love, they ain't worth the fake shit. They don't really like people switching up, and they can't be kinda controlling like bitch. Shut the fuck up Scorpios are leaders and they always think ahead And they also open minded so you gotta give them cred If you date in the Scorpio and they like you, they will make you happy They also like a meal so in the kitchen, no you can't be like Scorpios are often trendy and they got the best drip And they do not disappoint man, you just gotta tap in Tagging shit this video to a Scorpio you